Welcome back. First this half hour, an update on the tropics. That's right. Something could start to bubble in the Gulf and possibly have an impact on our weather next week. West News' Eric Burris is back with us for, with an update on those chances. And Eric, it feels like we've been talking about this for days now, but we haven't really seen anything form just yet. And I think that that's, that's really important. I, let's not forget, we're just starting to see bubble up of clouds, and yet the models have for days seen the future. It may not be perfect, but it really is a testament to the technology that we have. Now, this is all going to develop from what's known as a Central American gyre. Let me show you what I mean. Moisture from the Gulf moisture from the Pacific, moisture from the Caribbean. It's all kind of just spinning around Central America. And oftentimes you see these little spokes of energy. And the models have been doing a fantastic job of basically saying like something's going to start to form as it works its way over toward the Yucatan Peninsula. And just this afternoon, the National Hurricane Center said we are now seeing enough data to raise the development chance to 50%, 50-50 shot over the next seven days from the Caribbean into the Gulf of Mexico. And we think that while it would be slow over the next few days time, we're getting more and more confident that one of these little pieces of energy from that Central American gyre will develop and work into the Gulf of Mexico. So that's what we're watching at this moment in time is models developing something. But I've had a lot of people on social media asking, should we be ready in Dinellan? Should we be ready in Daytona Beach? And the answer is it's just far too early to get an idea. For now, the entire Gulf Coast needs to be watching this closely. But that said, we can at least share what the models are saying. And they're all kind of taking it generally off toward the northern Gulf Coast. But some runs take toward Florida, some runs take toward Texas. So at the end of the day, I think the takeaway is that models are developing something. But until it forms, the models are just that just ideas. Okay, so let's watch the tropics. But that said, we also need to be watching our weekend forecast. Let's do that in earnest when I see you in just a couple minutes.